Okay, so Amanda has left and she was staying in my office, so now I need to put that back together. My desk is here and it's messy, don't mind that. And then I have to like wash her blankets and stuff, but I need to move it back over here. I know my room looks really messy. It's always really messy. Don't judge me because I, I live here. It's okay, you can judge me. I get it. I found Amanda's earring. It broke. Well, I think that thing fell off, so I'll have to show her. going to hang up a picture right now because I took it down so I could put up like these posters here. <laughs> it's my horse picture. Well, I don't know. Poster board? I don't know what it is. My mom got it for me for Christmas a while ago. So yeah, I'm gonna hang it up now because I don't want it sitting on the ground. I don't like that. I don't know where I want to put this. Here? Here? I don't know. Damn it. Okay, one done. How do I make it even? I'm clearly a professional. Is this very scientific? Yes, it is. It's not perfect, but we're gonna see. Oh, that one won't catch. It's not even. What do we expect from me? I mean, I think it's good enough. This is what we're looking at. I'm taking all my perfume out of their boxes, so. I need to make more space because I kind of want to put more stuff on my shelf. And it's hard because I have so much. It's my own fault. I want to get like a little holder for these, like a little thing I can put these in just to stack them. I don't know if I have one, let me look. Honestly. We're just gonna use my Legend of Zelda mug because I can't be bothered. Just the vibe. put these away my albums and stuff this is the nana tour and then this is their season's greetings which it's funny because i saw this multiple times multiple k-pop stores i went to i didn't know who it was because i'm dumb and i can't read 17 like i was so confused because their color palette is like this right like these are their colors so i was expecting something like this but like <laughs> i didn't know who this was i felt so dumb <laughs> but i got it I think my 17 shelf is getting a bit too crowded. I really can't lie. I think it's getting a bit much. Because I can't fit everything now. It's so sad. I actually like this one the most. I still haven't opened these. That's so fucking pathetic, right? Like, it's so sad. I'll open them at some point. Just, like, save it for, like, a rainy day. I have a lot of 17 stuff. Oh, my gosh. I have these. I actually don't know why I got these. I'll do coops. I want to. Perfect. He looks so simple. He's just going to go here. Funny enough, my husband, he got this for me as well as like these candles, the 17 ones, for Valentine's Day. But when he showed me this, he thought this was Felix because the way that they had it labeled is that they had the name of the idol and then the idol was behind the picture. But he thought it was in front. So he picked Hyunjin thinking it was Felix because Felix is my favorite member of Stray Kids, which I still love Hyunjin. Like, I'm not complaining. But like, it was funny because we went to the same store with Amanda actually and I saw the Felix one and I was like, wait, they do have Felix. Why didn't you get him before? He's like, oh, I thought I did. <laughs> for IMs, it's kind of weird because I don't know why he put it in a bag. I'm a little confused by the way that they package this album, but whatever. I don't make the rules. I don't know where to put this. Like, that just blocks all my other albums. Like, what are we doing here? I need to reorganize these so it looks better because, like, I don't have a lot of, like, Monster X albums. I actually ordered the other version of this one, too, by the way. But my K-pop collection is definitely getting pretty, well, pretty big compared to what I had before. My bestie is here. He's looking out the window. I have to put the cat tower back over in this corner. 
corner and then his other bed, right? Alex is doing so much better since I've taken him to the dermatologist. His ears have cleared up so much. He used to itch all the time. He'd always have his ears flat, but now he doesn't really do that anymore. His ears have cleared up a lot. He's also taking steroids right now and he also gets ear medicine every single day. The steroids came just in time for me to finish them right before I go to Korea. I think literally like the day before I go to Korea is when they're gonna finish. Literally perfect timing. But it's 12.35 and I'm actually going to be trying to get tickets for TXT in an hour and a half basically. I signed up for the pre-sale so I can try and get tickets and I did get an access code and I'm nervous because I really want to go see them. <laughs> but it's weird because they're gonna be here when I'm in Korea. So I'm actually trying to get tickets for Chicago. So I'm like, you know, I had to pick between TXT and then Hyphen and I picked TXT and then they released the date when I'm not here. So I'm trying to get tickets for Chicago because I'll be back I think about a week before the Chicago show. So I'm gonna be doing that in a little bit. I'm nervous, but like, I don't know. I'm just really hoping I get a ticket. I'm going by myself, by the way. I don't need to get two tickets. It's just gonna be one for me, which I've never traveled by myself for like a concert. So it's gonna be interesting, <laughs> but I really, really want to go see them. There's a first for everything, right? I've never gone to a concert by myself, but I'll, I'll do it if I, if I can get tickets. <laughs> I'm stressed. I just stood up and she took my spot on my chair. Hi, sweet girl. You're so cute. Oh, I just got into the queue. It's 1,620 people in front of me, which is not a lot. So that's a good sign. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> oh my gosh. I still don't know what section I want to sit in. It's so bad. I was debating floor. I'm not even going to try for that. But I have a couple of sections that I'm really looking into. I'm so nervous. My heart is like beating so hard. I get so nervous whenever I have to get tickets. It's really bad. <laughs> I think it's because it's like, it's the anticipation right like I really want the tickets so I get like really scared that I'm gonna miss the opportunity or something oh my gosh it's a lot better than IU at least IU there was 7,500 for Chicago for Newark I think there was over 14,000 and it was the same for Oakland the queue is going really fast it's already at 13 well 1,300 1,378 sorry <laughs> exact numbers I actually already booked my hotel and my flight because I wanted to get ahead of the thing because the flights were pretty cheap and I wanted to just get my hotel done. 900 people. Wow, it's going really fast. <laughs> the fastest queue I ever got into was actually 17, which was the first K-pop concert I ever went to. That was very, very fast. Wow, it's going so fast. 750. Girl, what? Why is it so fast? 587. And again, I'm going by myself, so only one ticket is needed. So we just need to get one ticket, which I don't think I'm not going to get a ticket. I mean, the queue wasn't that crazy, but it's more like, am I going to get the section that I want? You know, I still don't even know where I want to sit. Oh my God, this is so bad. I should know where I want to go, but I don't. 456. 325. Not a lot. This is the quickest queue I've ever gotten into. This is quicker than Itzy. It was quicker than I've everything. Wow. This is crazy quick. 132. Oh, well, it is a pre-sale, so I wonder how many people actually sign up for the pre-sale. Oh, here we are. Wow. So quick. Let's see. Oh, right. Oh my god. $544. Oh my god, what? That's too expensive. I can't do that. That's not what I picked. That's not what I picked. That's crazy. Hell no. What? Oh my god. God, why are they so expensive? I was not expecting that. No, these are too expensive for those seats at least. Why are they so, oh my God, they're unbelievably expensive. I don't want to spend that much money on the ticket. Damn, it's pretty expensive. I was not expecting it to be five, six hundred dollars. Um, wow. I have a little bit of time before I like officially take my seat. Let me check. I mean, it's not a bad seat at all. Like I'll take it, but like, oh my God. So expensive. Cause I want an aisle seat so that way like I can see better. I think that would be best. I mean, I'll just, I think I'll just get it because otherwise that's the section I wanted and that's kind of the area I wanted. It's actually not the exact section that I wanted, but it's fine. I think that's not that bad. Oh my goodness. I feel sick because it's more expensive than I thought it would be. I was expecting like between three or $400. This is a really expensive ticket in my opinion. Holy shit. I feel like I'm going to throw up. That is crazy expensive. Not what I expected, but you know what? We'll see. I don't know. I feel like stress. Actually, that's going to be the cheapest one I can get. So I might as well just get it. It's just gonna keep going up from here. Damn, that's crazy. I, again, was not expecting them to cost as much as they actually are. I know it's expensive, right? Like I do, like I know that, but like the amount of money, I was expecting it to be less than IU and I spent less for IU, but it's an aisle seat, which is what I want so I can use the bathroom and stuff. Oh, so expensive. It's about 200 more than I expected to pay. My pre, 
fee purchase price that I wanted was originally gonna be like 400 or less, but it was like four something. So it's like, it's not that different, I guess. I'm happy I got tickets, but the price is just not what I expected. I was not expecting it to be so beyond expensive. I've talked about this before. I'm very fortunate that I have money in my life where I'm able to afford to do things like this. But when I was younger, like I grew up really, really poor. I had no money. I went to my first K-pop concert six years after I got into K-pop, something like that. I could not afford to go to these concerts like this. I could not afford to have a five or $600 ticket. I can't imagine people that can't. So it's such a privilege to be able to even purchase these, which I'm aware that I have that and I'm very grateful. It blows my mind for my younger self who couldn't afford to do these things and had to miss out on opportunities like this because it was so expensive. For me, then even $200 was really, really expensive for just any type of ticket, let alone $600. It's so insane. Okay, so I don't think it was that popular for this show based on the fact that there's only 12 people in front of me in the queue. Um, it obviously went very quick. Compared to any other artist I've been to, this is the quickest I've ever gotten through the queue. The price is unbelievable for this quick to get through the queue. I cannot believe it. How was it this expensive? I mean, again, I love TXT, but fucking Jesus. Yeah, they didn't have a lot of good, I mean, ah, oh shit, really? This is what happened last time with IU. I just wanna see like what they have and what the prices are looking like in general. I have the passcode, thank you. Oh, it's just like, oh, standing. Oh, no wonder my floor is not that popular. That makes sense. Standing is ridiculous. I would never stand, oh my God. See, everyone picked all these seats because these are actually the good seats to enjoy the show. Like these seats aren't as ideal. The one thing I like is picking an aisle seat is that no one's gonna be next to me blocking my view because I'm really short. So if there's a lot of people in front of me and I'm to the right of the stage, right? Like I'll be able to see everything very, very well. I'm very happy that I got tickets. I am very, very, very happy. But oh my gosh, do I wish they were not that expensive. I find it insane. And this is just the pre-sale. I got lucky that I got the pre-sale. And funny enough, I was waiting all day yesterday to see if I actually got the pre-sale code. And my dumb ass got the email, saw it, thought it was a random email telling me about the Oakland show because they're doing the tickets not through Ticketmaster for Oakland. And it was my pre-sale code. So I spent like six hours of my day being bummed because I'm like, oh my God, where's my pre-sale code? I didn't get one. I had it the whole time and I saw it at nine in the morning. I'm like, girl, you're so dumb. I'm gonna have to budget very well. I got tickets, but my goodness. Moa, are we doing okay? Because this is crazy. This is crazy expensive. Well, TXT, I'll see you in June. Took all my money. Like, damn it. It's okay. Another update. The tickets are now half the price that I paid. And this is why I don't like Ticketmaster's dynamic pricing. I bought a better ticket a few rows up for half the price I paid for when I entered the queue. And I do not understand why companies take advantage of people wanting to buy tickets and inflating the prices so much. I find it absolutely insulting. Like I got a better ticket for half the price that I paid. I see it this way. If I can resell the ticket for even half the price I paid, it's the same price anyway. So I'm going to resell the ticket later. It is just the pre-sale, but it's like, why in the world are we charging? so much money for the pre-sale. For the people that are like really big fans that sign up for it, why are we charging them out the gate five, six, seven hundred dollars, a thousand dollars, an hour and 14 minutes later, half the price, better seats. Why? Why is this a thing? I do not understand. I know that in Korea, the prices are regular. It's the same no matter where you go. You get the same price no matter how high the demand is. I do not understand why in America it is treated this way when it comes to concerts. Why am I paying so much more money for purchasing a ticket 40 minutes before and now that the demand is less, it's half the price. It's like, why inflate the price? Just regulate the price per row, per seat. You don't need to inflate it based on the demand. You can just have it where, okay, you're paying for this section you pay for this a much and we're gonna regulate that the whole time. Why is it based? I don't, I don't get it. You know, I don't know. Maybe I'm just being a stickler, but it's just like, again, it's so, I was so mad because of how expensive it was. So I bought the ticket because it's like, okay, well, they're not gonna go down and then they go down a lot. Maybe that's just my ignorance and that's why this happened to me, but I'm just gonna play it by ear for now. The show's two months away. I'll try to resell the ticket and at least get some of the money back. I got a better seat or way less money. So like my seat was 600. I got a better one for three. I don't know. So if I can resell my $600 seat for 300 bucks after the pre-sale goes and time goes on, then I will be happy. I realize now that the reason the tickets were so expensive is because they were platinum and I didn't know the difference and I looked it up and now I know my mistake. Lesson learned. Anyways, I got an album. I'm gonna open it. It won't open. I don't know why they're in this cage or this like 
thing. I don't know why he put them in a bag. I'm in like a sour mood now, I'm not gonna lie. As my husband said, there's nothing you can do, so just relax. Anyway, I got IM's album. I got the other version because I did it on the ground. I didn't know there was another one. So I guess these are some stickers that are in here that he has. It just says Overdrive. I haven't pre-ordered his new album. I meant to, but like, your girl be struggling, okay? The CD, which we all know that's the most important part of like a K-pop album, obviously. But this is the red version. So like, this is with this one and then the other one was that, the blue. Oh my gosh, this is scandalous. I wish I was this tall in this fit. It'd be really nice. I should wear cards so I could have apps like that. I'm not a man, but like, I can try. All right, let's see. He's so handsome. January 26, 1996. He's six months older than me. Oh, this one is cute. I like this one. I like this. I don't know what this is called. Like holographic. I don't know. Whatever. I feel like these are really popular now. Like these types of cards. They're cool though. I like that. Okay, this is putting me in a little bit of a better mood. I'm going to make dinner too. I'm making chicken quesadillas. I've made them in a while. All right, let's see. I got my photo cards. Ah, no, I dropped, I dropped them on the floor. I'm not going to look. I'm going to open up to a random page and show you guys. Look at him. He looks so good. This man out here living his best life. I love that for him. <laughs> Most of the pictures make him look so tall. This one makes him look so short. It's so funny. Live your best life, sir. Oh, I forgot he has tattoos. Look at him. I can never get a tattoo on my back like that. It's like rough. I mean, I have like a couple tattoos, but like, girl, we ain't doing that again. Look at that. Actually, Amanda wants to get matching friendship tattoos, but like, we can't decide what we want. So I'm like, to be like that. Why does he have to make like the goofiest faces in his photo cards? He must not take it very seriously. I don't blame him. I wouldn't either. There's this one and this one. And then this is his other photo card. He always makes such goofy faces. I don't know. <laughs> this man, you can tell this man does not take this seriously. I love that. That's his album. It's cute. I'm gonna put it literally, I'm gonna put it right next to the other one, which is like right here. I'm gonna make dinner now because I'm trying not to be in a bad mood about the TXT ticket. I was so worried about not getting them and now I'm mad about how much I paid for them. <laughs> so I'm having the opposite problem. <laughs> Onions make me cry. They're so awful. Like, why? What did I do wrong? Amanda left yesterday, but apparently she got me a gift. I don't know what this is, but we're gonna open it. She's so funny, I can't. Okay, so she kept yelling at me when I was here about my photo cards because I don't put them anywhere and they're all a mess. So she bought me a photo card holder and it's Stray Kids. <laughs> Which is so random, first of all. Not only that, but this is, I love her and I'm gonna tell her this. They don't have nine members anymore. They only have eight. So this is wrong. She's so cute though, I can't. Cause I keep my photo cards in the albums, but like also, oh it unzips. Ta all my photo cards can go in here. I have so many photo cards, it's embarrassing. I have like a stack of photo cards, just like randomly that I have, that like do not have a home. These are just photo cards that I've like taken out before and stuff. And they're just like, like let's see. These are some of my favorites that I have. Like these are all just sitting on my shelf. It's like Felix, Mingyu, Joshua, Wanu again. Sorry, Mingyu, oh my goodness. Wanu, the eight, Hoshi, Wanu, ATs with their light stick. What is this? Oh, this is Joshua again. He was in a book. Usually photo cards are my bookmarks. San, which looks like Hrang Hei hands. I, mm, listen sir, wrong fandom. Wanu, Uyo. This is my favorite picture ever. I like this one and I like the one with um Songkwan with bananas because they're just so random and funny. This is my favorite picture. 
picture of me and you. So cute. And then these are just 17 photo cards from somewhere. I don't even know. Want you. Want you. There's this one. Gone. Let's see. No song. Where'd you go? Girl, what? Where'd he go? That bitch disappeared. Right? Um, hello. There's only so many photo cards here. The fuck? There it is. I slipped over. These are my two favorite. Like, look how cute these are. Well, I guess I have some organizing to do. Not right now, but I'll do it later because, I don't know. I think what I'll do is I'll put like my random photo cards in it. If I haven't taken it out of an album yet, I probably won't put it in there. I don't know, let's see. Cause I know this can hold a lot of photo cards, but like I have a lot, so this could get filled easily. Hmm, I will debate what to do, but thank you Amanda, I appreciate it. Now I have one cause she kept yelling at me and I was like, I don't need one. That's cause we went to a K-pop store and they had a bunch of like binders, I think. So she was like, girl needs to organize her shit. 